Hello again, got another micro lecture for you. This one is on the meaning of slope in a velocity versus time graph. As always, you need three bullet points worth of notes, a one to two sentence summary, and the follow-up questions on Google Forms. All right, so we've got a graph over here of velocity versus time. So time on the x-axis, velocity on the y-axis, and it's for a cart rolling down a hill. We can see the velocity starts at zero and ends up at four, or sorry, at 16 and it takes four seconds based on that x value. So what I have to tell you for this one is that the slope in a velocity versus time graph is the acceleration. So if slope is rise over run, and if the rise is in velocity and the run is in time, that gives us velocity over time, which is simply acceleration. So to calculate it, what we would do is we'd plug in and literally just figure out the slope. In this case, it would be 16 minus 4, or sorry, 16 minus 0, so 16 minus 0 for the rise, so that tells us how high up it went, and 4 minus 0 for the run, which basically just tells us how far to the right it went. In this case, that gives us 16 over 4, or 4 meters per second squared, and that would be the acceleration of this cart, and we could figure that out, or we figured that out from the slope of the graph. That's it for this one. You might rewatch it. Graphs kind of trip people up sometimes. Uh, the You need three bullet points worth of notes, one to two sentence summary, and follow-up questions on Google Forms.